Hi guys, welcome back to Home Crux. My name is Priya and today I'm going to make a quick dry concrete planter using these plastic bowls. Here I have my quick dry concrete, but first I'm going to wear my gloves. Take a cup of water and start adding your quick dry cement. We need a very liquidy gravy like consistency so you can adjust the amount of water or cement once you get going. Mix it until you don't see any of these lumps. So I'm going to use a slightly bigger bowl because I want this platter to be big in size. So what we are going to do is place our bowl on a plate or flat surface and start pouring a quick dry concrete mixture into it. So when it is almost half, we are going to press this. Place some pebbles on the top bowl so it doesn't move and float away. Now we are going to fill it to the brim. We have filled a bowl and pressed down the upper bowl to create a nice vessel. Don't worry, we can create a hole at the bottom for the planter so that water can excess water can drain out. Now we are going to leave it for about one to two hours and then we are going to take it out as it is a quick dry concrete. It won't need much time to set and we will have to take the bowls out while it is still a about 10 to 20 percent uh, wet so let's keep it aside and we will come back for results it's been three hours let's take the bowls out first dump the pebbles then we are going to remove the bowls first i'm going to scrape the excess off. I want the inner bowl and gently remove it. Now turn it upside down. Tease the exterior bowl and gently and gently pull the planter out. Now we are going to smooth the edge using a knife or a craft knife. Poke a hole at the bottom using a small screwdriver. Now as the concrete is still a little bit wet, it's easy to make a tiny hole. This will allow drainage in our planter. Now we are going to let it dry for 24 hours and then we are going to plant a succulent or something in it. So our planter with quick dry cement is dried up. Add some stones at the bottom right around the hole so the soil won't get out add some soil so i have a couple of plants here some succulents i'm going to try and create a forest scape in this planter these will be the trees So our plants are in place but it could do with a little bit of landscaping. So I'm going to use some tiny pebbles and stones. Mm -hmm. 
and here is our concrete planter with beautiful succulent landscape in it. 